off to third, inside signature Silster fourth, outside and coming three wide, La Sorciere from five, they move on past the three quarters, Giorgio on or La Sorciere gaining ground quickly on the outside, is moving on to take over the lead, that's La Sorciere opening up by three, Giorgio on or is second, on the inside and trapped third, as they move past the seven eights, and off the top there, Maple Grove Lars, 127 and four, three quarters, it's La Sorciere clear by five. Stretch they come, La Sorciere, Amber's runaway jet on the outside, La Sorciere reporting home a two length winner. They come, second beat evasion of the Phillies will go to La Sorciere, trying to go to win it by three. They're coming on down the home stretch, La Sorciere in her retirement mile. Can she do it? Can she do it? Yes, she can, Claire. It's La Sorciere. and uh, pacing. Luck is a lady tonight at the rail is a way to grab the early lead. This Island Earth outside second. Grabbing cover is Clark Gable third, then getting away to sit in four. That's La Sorciere. Followed the fifth on the inside as they move to the back stretch by life of the ball. Justin's choice outside in six, back seventh at the rail. That's Highbrow and uh, treading a field as they move down the back stretch, big and gentle. They move out of the opening quarter up front. Luck is a lady tonight. Leads the way half a length. Parked and driving outside this Island Earth. Now driving on to take over the lead. This Island Earth moves to the front. Second, Luck is a lady tonight. Then on the inside, racing a third. That's Clark Gable, followed by La Sorciere fourth. Looking at it from a five is life of the ball. Back at the rail and pacing in six. That's Highbrow. Then racing a seventh and moving on the outside. Big and gentle, Justin's choice is now treading. The quarter reached in 28 and three. They're midway through the stretch as they approach the halfway point. Luck is the lady tonight. Now up with a reclaiming move. Has taken over the lead once again as they arrive at the half. Uncovered outside. La Sorciere second in the pocket. This Island Earth racing third. Following cover outside. Life of the ball is sitting in four. Inside. Nowhere to go. Clark Gable fifth. Sixth and moving on the outside. That's big and gentle. Followed by Highbrow. And Justin's choice is eighth and treading. 59 and one was the half. Into the back stretch. They head to three quarters. La Sorciere. Now drives on to take over, opening up a quick two and a half length lead. Luck is a lady tonight is second. Outside, life of the ball is moving third. Outside and up into contention now. Sitting in four is Clark Gable. They head out of the seven eights. It's La Sorciere by three. Second now. That is life of the ball. Luck is a lady tonight backing off third. Outside racing fourth. Clark Gable, 128 and two. Was the three quarters. They swing off the turn and straight now for the stretch drive. And they're chasing La Sorciere. Back second is life of the ball. Outside, Clark Gable, down the stretch they come. La Sorciere will win it by two and a half, three lengths. Finishing a second. That is life of the ball, tight for third. Luck is the lady tonight trying to hold off Clark Gable. Sorciere, a brown mare seven by Largo out of Sorceress. She is by Albatross, owned by James Burton of Toronto, Nova Scotia. James also does the training. Claire McDonald is aboard for the mayor's first win of the season. She gets the job done in one fifty-eight flat. Claire McDonald, La Sorciere, one fifty-eight flat. They're off and uh, pacing all day. Gray at the rail, quickly away to grab the early lead. DJ's on his way, crossing over to grab a seat second, getting away to sit in the three. As they race by the opening eighth is La Sorciere. The fourth one is Bert and Bert. Outside racing in five as they continue into the back stretch for time one. That's Rookie's Raisin. Then inside in a six, Kilcarrion Whisper, followed by Stick Up Hanover. And GR's Heritage is treading the field. They race past the opening quarter all day gray. Rookie's Raisin quickly driving up. Uncovered is now sitting a second out the rail. DJ's on his way. He is spotted third. La Sorciere racing fourth. Stick Up Hanover underway on the outside. He is gapped in the cover sitting in five at the rail in six. Is Bert and Bert back to kill Karen Whisper. And at the back of the field is GR's Herod's 29 and 2. Was the quarter. They move off the turn and race into the stretch now as they approach the half. It's still all day gray leading the way. Outside and braving it first over. 
As they arrive at the half, his rookies Raisin sitting in the pocket. DJ's on his way, his third. Stick up Hanover. Well spotted second over now in four. Fifth and buried out the rail is La Sorcière. Moving to the outside, Bert and Bert in a sixth. Then kill carrying Whisper. And at the back of the field is GR's Harrods. 59 and two was the half. The end of the back stretch. They head to three quarters. All day gray, rookies raising outside is now on even terms as they approach three quarters on the outside and now sticking a neck in front. That's rookies raising all day gray trying to fight back second. Stick up Hanover. La Sorcier is out three wide fourth inside fifth. DJ's on his way. Then GR's Harrods, Burton and Burt and Kel Curran whisper as they race now to the seven eight. It's rookies raising, but on the outside, La Sorcier now sticking a neck in front as they round the top turn. La Sorcier, rookies raising, stick up Hanover. GR's here, it's coming on for fourth. 129 and three, three quarters. La Sorcier, rookies raising on the inside, trying to fight back. La Sorcier and rookies raising. La Sorcier will win it. Rookies raising, second to third, stick up Hanover. Of the 12th race, the Halloween pace, sponsored by Carter Graphics, number three, La Sorcier, seven year old mare by Largo. Owned and trained by Roy Burton of Toro. Claire McDonald's third one of the afternoon. La Sorcière in two minutes, two fifths. by trade, out and Adam, La Sorcière, Centurion, Thunder, Frank and Muir, Cam's Powerball, here they come. And there they go with a goaltender by trade, pointed here. Out and Adam's into the two hole, and La Sorcière is about to drop in third. Centurion, Thunder on around the turn, to checking into fourth, checking his family ties fourth. Then Largo's bounty, Centurion, Thunder gets away in sixth. Facing from seventh as they move along the back stretch. That's Frank and Muir. And Cam's Powerball, the trailer, they get strung out early here. A goaltender by trade. He loves the early going. We may see some solid fractions in here. That's a goaltender by trade. Yes, sir. Boom. Just like that, it's 27 four to open it up here. A goaltender by trade firing here in the early going. Out and out of his second, La Sorcier sticking right with those leaders. Third, well back in fourth, family ties. Pacing fifth, that's the Largo's bounty. Six on the outside, that's Centurion Thunder. Then in seventh, Frank and Muir. And Cam's Powerball, the trailer, opening half mile, 57! And one, wow, he rolled him along over to the 5H. That's a goaltender by Trey, but out and at him, coming to him here. Third, La Sorcière, back in the foot, family ties. Fifth on the outside, Centurion Thunder, then six towards the rail, Lagos Bounty. Outside, Frank and Muir, seventh, and the trailer, Cam's Powerball, three quarters gone by in a one. 28 and two. Here comes La Sorcière on the outside. Out and Adam now second. A goaltender by trade. A winded third. Back to fourth. Centurion Thunder. Down the stretch they come. This is Claire McDonald. That's La Sorcière here in the fifth. Out and Adam is second. And a goaltender by trade. Stayed for third. It's La Sorcière in 157. And four. Sold in train by James Burton of Toronto, Nova Scotia. Ladies and gentlemen, the winningest female driver in Canadian harness racing history, Claire McDonald in the driver's seat. 157 and four. Le Sorcier. Sorcier, Aria, Aria, T Bear Kate, Albert Rules. Blazing guns on the run here as they get away. Designer towel out to the front. Second is plea bargain. And third from the outside is Albert Rules as they race round the turn. Facing fourth towards the inside, Le Sorcier. Away fifth is Dream Fair Shanahan. Then racing six, Aria Aria. Facing from seven, T Bear Kate. And Blazing Guns never got into it here in the backfield trailing. Albert Rules and John McDonald up front on the lead.
There goes Barry O with the post time favorite, plea bargain underway after him. Pacing third at the rail, designer towel, the sorcier is foot, capped out in fifth, dream fair Shanahan, then Aria Aria, T Bear Kate, blazing guns in the backfield, trailing 28. And two, that's the opener. Here comes the half, and plea bargain cleared. Second is Albert Rules, racing third at the rail. That's designer towel, the source of the air. Up with the leaders, fourth. Dream Fair Shanahan is fifth. Aria, Aria tipping out six. T-Bear Kate back seventh, and blazing gun in the backfield. 56 and two, wow! 28 seconds flat in the second quarter here. Plea bargain takes Barry O to three quarters on the lead. Here comes Designer Towel starting on the outside, and he's fresh here, going right after the leader. Moving up third, Le Sorcier. Fourth along the rail, that's Albert Rules. In fifth, Dream Fair Shanahan. New leader, Designer Towel, and Campbell went right to the front and opened up. Eighth of a mile left to go. Three quarters and a one. 26 and a one fifth. Here they come down. It's designer towel. Le Sorcier in the outside. Dream Fair Shanahan on the line. Designer towel. Big trip out of him for Campbell. Second, Le Sorcier. Dream Fair Shanahan third. 155. Three fifths. They're off and uh, pacing, quick off the wings. Presenter Frost looking for the early lead, and at the rail is Wildside uh, second, and driving up on the outside, who is it as a way third, and the outside uh, fourth. As they continue by the opening eighth is Dark and Lace. They race into the box straights first time as they head on to the opening quarter. Out front, that's presenter Frost leading the way by a length. Wild side gets away in the pocket. Then out the rail and racing out of three as they check in at the opening quarter. That is Dark and Lace. Looking at it from four in the early going. Blissful Sky, La Sorcier has five. Back there to HV Jimmy in six. Then who is it? And uh, Nutton trails the field. Single file as they race on over to the 3H 28 and four was the opening quarter. Out front, it's presenter Frost on top of length and a half. Wild side is getting the pocket trip. At the rail is Dark and Lace third, inside fourth. That is Blissful Sky. Now, first up from five comes La Sorcier, followed by HV Jimmy in a six. Back there in seven and moving in the outside is Nutton. And treading, who is it? Into the turn. They race on over to the five eights, and it's still pre center Frost in charge. Wild side now stepping to the outside, second. Inside racing third. As they continue on to the three quarters is Dark and Lace. Outside with cover now, La Sorcier is pacing fourth. Half in 59 and uh, three fifth seconds. They're on the way to three quarters. Pre center Frost at the rail on the outside. That is Wild Side uncovered second with cover. La Sorcier is on the limb racing third. Inside Dark and Lace has four. Coming four wide into five. That's who is it. Racing on to the 7 8 pre center Frost. Wild Side alongside. La Sorcier getting a second over toe as well spotted. Now tipping three high third. 129 and three. Three quarters. Pre center Frost trying to fight off Wild Side and three high is La Sorcier. Down the stretch they come. It's pre center Frost, wild side outside, three high. La Sorcier, pre center Frost, La Sorcier is closing in at the line. It's tight. La Sorcier looking to nose out pre center Frost and wild side. Now back the winner of race 11, number four, La Sorcier, 10 year old daughter of Largo. 
Owned and trained by Roy Burton and driven by Claire McDonald, La Sorciere, winning in 2.01. The fourth, post time. The Ralph Van Pacing leaving from the rail to all American Kelly. Just Jesse is second and way wide for third as they move into the turn now. Going to the opening eighth, racing from fourth. That is, I think you're in my way. Racing fifth at the rail, Le Sorciere. Then sixth is Down East Liz, facing seven White Sand Jester in the early trailer. That is Stena Reno. Up the back stretch they go. And on the front end, just Jesse, the leader. I think you're in my way, is coming to her on the outside. Facing third towards the rail. As they wheel on by that opening quarter mile is All American Kelly. Quarters up in 29 seconds flat. Racing from fourth this full pardon. Le Sorcier at the rail fifth. Then in six, it's Down East Liz. Facing seventh, White Sand Jester. Stena Ray No is dropped out of it here. He's in the backfield. Opening half mile is up next, and the midway point lead goes to I Think You're In My Way. Here comes Full Pardon now. Up and at her on the outside. Third up the rail. That is just Jesse. Le Sorcier has got some cover. Fourth on the outside with All-American Kelly. Fifth, 59 and two, opening half mile, three eights to go. Up front, it's I think you're in my way. Second is full pardon, Le Sorcier. Three high and coming third. Fourth towards the rail. They move along the back stretch. That is just Jesse. Down East Liz now fifth. Pacing six, All-American Kelly. Three quarters and 130 and two. And Le Sorcier coming for the lead on the outside. I think you're in my way at the rail. Down East Liz, she's into it here third. And they're coming on down the home stretch. Le Sorcier in her retirement mile. Can she do it? Can she do it? Yes, she can, Claire. It's Le Sorcier in her final heat of her racing career. She has won it tonight at Charlottetown. I think you're in my way. And down East Liz, the closest to her. Look at the mile, folks. 158 and 4, 28 and 2, closing quarter. Well, I'll tell you what, this is special, Vance, down here in the winner circle. The applause for this mayor, and what a way to end a career. You're exactly right, Lee, and that is 35. Lifetime victories for a remarkable maritime.